Hey there boys and girls, have you ever wanted to add an animated watch face to your Apple Watch? Well stick around and I'll show you how. To do this, we'll have to use Apple's Live Photo feature. On your camera, in the top right hand corner, there's a symbol to turn on Live Photos. Now anytime you take a photo, you'll end up with a very short video. It's a photo consisting of several frames. To test this, we can select that photo and we can scroll through it. So now I'm going to access one of my favorite live photos. This is one of my dogs. Hit edit and in the bottom left hand corner there's a circular symbol to get us into the keyframe editor. I'm going to shorten things up a little bit and then I'm going to adjust the keyframe to one of the photos closer to the end. Hit done and now we're going to want to hit the bottom left hand symbol for sharing and then we're going to scroll down until we see create watch face. Select the watch face, and I'm going to move the writing there, the 1009, down to the bottom of the screen so I can see my dog's face. Hit add, and we're all set to test this out. Yup, there she is. There's my dog. But we're not limited to using just your own live photos. In this example, I'm going to use the Jiffy app. We're going to use an animated GIF. So let's do a search. Maybe we'll search for something pretty popular, something everyone will know. Of course, Homer Simpson. So we'll pull up an animated GIF. In the top right hand corner, you'll see three dots. We'll press that. It gives us a choice to convert to live photo. So we're going to select save live photo as full screen. We can always crop it later. So we'll pull it up in the photo app, edit. We're going to first crop it. We'll cut out all the unwanted area. Crop it in nice and close. And then once again, we're going to hit that circular symbol down in the bottom left hand. You get a keyframe editor and we'll select one of the end keyframes, hit done. And of course the share button there in the bottom left go down to create watch face select the watch move the time down to the bottom of the screen we're also going to add the uh, battery uh, battery health so we can see that as well hit add and now it's time to test it out Don't. anyway i hope you found this video helpful thanks for watching and now you know.